Welcome back. So although it's been uh, pretty cold back there at home, uh, the guys have been working. So um, this is last week actually on Friday is um, Brian just doing, trimming some of these ribs off here. So we've got the um, router table set up there um, and this is sped up a little bit and he's just uh, trimming off the edge of all these uh, wing ribs and strake ribs. And this is what it looks like uh, when they're all done. So that's pretty much all of the ribs there that make up uh, the internals of the wing strakes so we got you know some of the end ones there and some of the center ones and the and the couple there that made up to where um, those the ones in the center are the ones that made up to where the wheel wells are uh, but anyway in the coming episodes you'll see those all being uh, test fitted into place um, once the guys have uh, created the strake skins And so now they're underway uh, with the ones for the actual wings themselves, the ribs. So they've obviously done uh, quite a few of them. These are the trailing edge ones or some of the trailing edge ones, as you can see. They have a point on the end. So these ones have already been laid up and they just need to be trimmed on that routing table the same way that uh, Brian was doing those last ones. And uh, you can see, looks like uh, Devon, I believe, is uh, laying up one of the internal ones so you've got like a back set you've got a middle set and then you've got a front set um, so the middle set they're kind of just sort of a bit rectangular um, you know with a little bit of uh, slope on them and uh, here's Devin just uh, putting down the peel ply and here they are under a vacuum bag so those two are done and uh, looks like didn't have any problems um, with doing those so they're actually flying through now and they're going to have all the wing ribs done um, in by the end of this week I think and uh, here's another uh, couple here different ones that have also been done so if they get uh, all of the ones done uh, for the wing ribs by the end of this week they may actually be able to lay up um, one at least one or maybe two of the skins for the strake uh, next week and here's Devin uh, beginning the layup on one of the leading edge uh, ribs for the wings so you can see on the left hand side of it there it has sort of the rounded leading edge as opposed to uh, the trailing edge ones um, that have the, the point on them and the more rectangular ones that you saw just now which uh, are in the mid span of the wing so he's it looks like he's got one or two layers down there already so it'll be one or two layers and uh, then uh, the foam quarter inch foam core and then the remaining and there you can see he's putting down or he's got the core in there as well and just wetting that down in preparation for putting uh, the extra or the finished layers on there to close the whole thing out. So and then it'll be peel ply and bag and tag. And uh, that's exactly what Jeff's doing here. He's already got all the other uh, materials in there, the um, breather fabric and such. And he's just uh, prepping the bag right now. And I've sped this up um, so you can see what's going on. But basically what he does here is just gets the bag sealed and then just cracks the valve a little bit on the uh, vacuum tank for this particular line just to start drawing um, the vacuum on there and then he can push all the corners in and make sure that the bag's sort of stretching out and everything's going to sit nicely and uh, once he's done that he just gives the valve a full open on there and you'll see it pulls down yeah, pulls down tight for the last bit and uh, that's how you do it and these again are the plugs for the upper and lower skins for the elevators and it looks like they've had the um, second coat of primer put on there or the final coat of primer and just uh, ready for final sanding and uh, here's Keith uh, working on that final sanding so once that's done they'll be ready for waxing and um, shortly after that be able to pull the mold and if you recall this is the mold for those uh, flanges that mate between the fuselage and the upper strake skins and here you can see Devin is just in the process of doing uh, the layup uh, for those parts and I can't remember exactly uh, how many layers of carbon fiber are involved in those but anyway you can see he's uh, in the process of doing that and so it won't be long and those parts will be created and meanwhile back down under just a little bit of video for you this is actually the view of the town um, where my mother lives here so it's this Marimbula in New South Wales and that's looking across the lake there so it's kind of nice and there's another view sort of from the left of that last one looking through the trees and out here towards the ocean 
So it's super pretty. There's lots of walking trails and that and really been uh, enjoying it and getting a little bit of relaxation relaxation in. And this is a uh, sort of a little bit down the coast here and uh, if you think Australia has the best beaches you're probably right. These are just beautiful and there's nobody there. Literally you've got the whole place to yourself so I walked down onto the beach here and not another soul to be had and the beach is probably I don't know 200 meters wide and beautiful emerald water there can't ask for much more than that so uh, yeah really having a good time and the weather's being good here and I'm sorry to hear that everybody's freezing back there in the US but you know I'll be back there soon enough as well and finally there's a view um, from my mum's place anyway that's our update for the first half of this week and thanks again for watching